Hi, Cancer. This is a peek at your partner for the week of July the 2nd through July the 8th, 2023. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see for the partner of the star sign of Cancer for July the 2nd through July the 8th, 2023. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see. For the partner of the star sign of Cancer for July the 2nd through July the 8th, 2023. Universal energies, show me what I need to see. For the partner of the star sign of Cancer for July the 2nd through July the 8th, 2023. Show me. Happy birthday, Cancer. Happy birthday. You guys, subscribe, like, comment, and share these videos. If this does not resonate with you, check your moon, rising, and Venus sign videos. I do not read reversals. So, Cancer. Cancer, this is a peek at your partner. So, Cancer, your partner has the sun. Your partner has the six of wands. Your partner has the king of pentacles. Your partner has the two of cups. And your partner has the empress. So, Cancer, your partner has the sun. Could be dealing with a Leo. But the sun symbolizes exuberance, illumination, happiness, joy, peace, love, abundance, growth and development, and freedom. So listen, Cancer could be dealing with a Leo, but your partner could tell me that they're happy, they want to be happy, they're over the moon, or something was illuminated, something came to light. Clarify the sun for Cancer's partner. Clarify the sun. <clears throat> For Cancer's partner, clarify the sun. For Cancer's partner, it is clarified with the tower. The tower is Aries and Scorpio's energy. This is something that your partner doesn't see coming. Something that catches them completely off guard. Something that just rocks the foundation of you guys' relationship. This is a shock in our moment. A moment of revelation. Now this can be a shocking shakeup or a breakup. So Cancer, very well could be a shocking surprise, shocking revelation, something being revealed, or a breakup. Clarify the tower for Cancer's partner. Clarify the tower for Cancer's partner. Clarify the tower for Cancer's partner. It is clarified with the star. Could be dealing with an Aquarius, but the star symbolizes having hope, having faith, healing, getting their wish, being divinely guided, following their destiny. So Cancer could be dealing with an Aquarius, but your partner could tell me that they're getting their wish, following their destiny. Your partner could tell me that they need to heal individually on their own, or they're holding out hope and faith that you guys can heal things, mend things, work things out, and reconcile. Clarify the star for Cancer's partner. Clarify the star for Cancer's partner. Clarify the star for Cancer's partner. Cancer, you're at the bottom of the deck. It is clarified with the hermit. Could be dealing with a Virgo. But right now, your partner's taking some time out to be alone, to do some soul searching, introspection, searching their inner man for wisdom and guidance, going within, looking for answers. So Cancer, could be dealing with a Virgo. But your partner could tell me that, hey, I just need some me time. Your partner could tell me that they're doing some heavy duty soul searching or they went on a solo search looking for something. Clarify the hermit for Cancer's partner. Clarify the hermit for Cancer's partner. Clarify the hermit for Cancer's partner. It is clarified with you, Cancer, the chariot. Your partner is determined to move forward confidently, victoriously, successfully ahead. 
Now, this can speak to travel. This can speak to relocating cities, states, countries. This can speak to moving from one residence to another or simply moving forward and leaving things behind. But your partner is determined to move forward confidently. But Cancer, this is you. Clarify the chariot. But Cancer's partner. Clarify the chariot. But Cancer's partner. What does Cancer's partner think of Cancer? What does Cancer's partner think of Cancer? Clarify the chariot for Cancer's partner. It is clarified with the Two of Cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is, we see eye to eye, face to face. We are spiritually connected. We are one. We are meant to be. We are soulmates. Soulmates with a divine union, a divine connection. So Cancer, listen, your partner thinks that you guys are soulmates. You're their babe. However, this can also be in an agreement. Now listen, Cancer, your partner could tell me that, you know what, I'm thinking long and hard here. You know, I want to make this move towards my wish. It may be a shocking surprise for their happiness with their soulmate, you, okay? Maybe you just don't see this coming. However, your partner could tell me that something was illuminated, something came to light, some type of shocking revelation here. And they're just needing time to be by themselves to heal. Because something, something could have been illuminated concerning you or you guys' connection. We will see. Cancer, your partner has a six of wands. Aries, Leo or Sag. This is getting attention, getting recognition, rising above the crowd, getting the accolades, the pats on the back, being triumphant, getting the victory, victory and success. But this can also speak to something being brought to your partner's attention or they're beginning to recognize something or they're getting attention and recognition. So Cancer, your partner could be getting your attention. You could be getting their attention. Your partner could tell me that something is being brought to their attention. They're beginning to recognize something here or this is an announcement being made. Clarify the six of wands for Cancer's partner. Clarify the six of wands for Cancer's partner. Clarify the six of wands for Cancer's partner. It is clarified with the ace of wands. Hmm. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This is a brand new, passionate, creative endeavor. Now, this can be the spark of a new idea. This can be some type of exciting, passionate communication, exciting, passionate action. But this one is symbolic of the male phallic and using the male phallic to be intimate. So brand new, passionate beginnings. So Cancer, listen, your partner could tell me that they have the spark of a new idea. Could be initiating something here. This can be passionate communication, romantic passion, or a heated discussion or argument, or starting a passionate new beginning. Now listen, Cancer, your partner could tell me that something was brought to their attention and began to recognize something here. Because something could be being illuminated and exposed here that caused a passionate, heated discussion or argument between you guys. Your partner could tell me that something was brought to their attention concerning you starting a passionate new beginning somewhere else. And this may have caused a shocking shakeup and a breakup and they're needing to heal. However, your partner could tell me that you're getting their attention or they're getting your attention and you guys are getting some cookies here. Or your partner's telling me that something is being brought to their attention. I'm sorry, your partner's telling me that they're having the spark of a new idea, wanting to make some type of an announcement here. Could be a shocking surprise that you don't see coming. We'll see. Cancer, your partner has the King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This king is usually stable, rooted, grounded, traditional, believes in the institution of marriage and family, someone who is good with managing finances and material resources. This could be a business owner, CEO, independent contractor, manager. So listen, Cancer, could be dealing with Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or someone with Earth prominent in their charts. However, when we're dealing with the King of Pentacles, the King of Pentacles is a married, stable, committed person. So you could be dealing with a spouse. King of Pentacles is a nurturing father figure. So you could be dealing with the parent of your child. Could be dealing with someone you work with or do business with or have some type of joint assets, resources, and property with, or a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Clarify the King of Pentacles. For Cancer's partner, 
Clarify the King of Pentacles for Cancer's partner. Clarify the King of Pentacles for Cancer's partner. It is clarified with the Ten of Cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is emotional fulfillment. This is the apex card. This is the happy family, happy life, happy wife, happy, stable, committed relationship, and happy home. This is what we're all striving for. So we're speaking of marriage, commitment, home, family, emotional fulfillment. So Cancer, listen, you know, someone very well may have commitment on the brain. But in tarot, tens are ending, so it could be an ending to you guys' commitment, marriage, living together situation, or family dynamics. You know, I see both things happening here, okay? Either someone wants to go into a commitment and make things more committed and stable between you guys, mm -hmm. or there's an ending because there's been a shocking revelation. Something has been brought to their attention, a shocking shakeup or a breakup in an ending here. So we will see. <laughs> Cancer, your partner has a two of cups again, again. So listen, yes, you're very well their soulmate, but this can also be in an agreement. Clarify the two of cups for Cancer's partner. Clarify the two of cups for Cancer's partner. Clarify the two of cups for Cancer's partner. Who is this? Earth sign. Page of Pentacles. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is news or a message about a solid, stable, committed offer. Now, this can be the news about an offer for an invite out for dinner and a movie. This can be about making things more committed. This can be about a lump sum of money, a job offer, a raise, a promotion, a bonus, a high ticket item purchase, a new home, a new car, a token of love, a gift anything of value. This is the news or message of it. So cancer, some type of news about practicality, money, assets, resources, property, accepting a gift, giving a gift, going out on a date or a commitment. Clarify the page of pentacles for cancer's partner. Clarify the page of pentacles for cancer's partner. Clarify the page of pentacles for cancer's partner. It is clarified with the lovers. Could be dealing with a Gemini. But the lover says, you know, I breathe you in. You breathe me in. We are so magnetically attracted to one another. We cannot get enough of one another. Babe, I need to make a choice. So listen, Cancer, your partner could tell me that you guys have this strong twin flame magnetic pull. Yes. Your partner could tell me there's another other lover. But the lovers could also be a partnership with work or business. Could be dealing with a Gemini. Clarify the lovers for Cancer's partner. Clarify the lovers for Cancer's partner. Clarify the lovers for Cancer's partner. It is clarified with the Three of Pentacles. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is making plans to meet up, making plans to partner up, to work together on a contract or a project. This is teamwork. This is collaboration. Now, this can speak to there being a third party involved, but this can also speak to your partner being willing to work on it or put in the work. An agreement, partnership, an agreement here. Listen, Cancer, your partner could tell me that they're willing to work on it, willing to put in the work. Your partner could tell me that this is all work or business. Your partner could tell me that this is some type of an agreement or a contract collaboration, or there's a third party. Now listen, Cancer, your partner could tell me, dealing with my soulmate, you know, I heard the news of them accepting a gift, giving a gift, going out on a date with another other lover, a third party here, and this is why things are ending. I discovered that they started a passionate new beginning, so there's a shocking shakeup and maybe even a breakup. However, your partner could tell me that we have this strong twin flame magnetic pull here, soulmate energy, twin flame energy. And they're wanting to come in with some type of news of commitment here, wanting to go into some type of an agreement, a marital agreement. <sighs> we will see. <laughs> Cancer, your partner has the Empress. Could be dealing with a Libra or a Taurus, but the Empress signifies beauty, fertility, creativity, nurturing energy, love, abundance, growth and development. This is a pregnant woman. She is symbolic of the Mother Earth. She takes the seed of something and nurtures it so that it grows abundantly. So Cancer, listen, could be dealing with a Libra or a Taurus. 
Could be dealing with a spouse because the empress is a married, stable, committed person. Could be dealing with the parent of your child or someone who's expecting. Now, this can be about your partner's abundance, but it could also be about nurturing the relationship. Clarify the empress for cancer's partner. Clarify the empress for cancer's partner. Clarify the empress for cancer's partner. <clears throat> It is clarified with the Eight of Cups, Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is walking away from people, places, and things that no longer serve them. This is your partner detaching emotionally, feeling emotionally drained, and just walking away from people, places, and things that no longer serve them. So, Cancer, listen, your partner could tell me that they're walking away, detaching emotionally. But when we're dealing with the Eight of Cups, this is someone who's leaving in search of their Nine of Cups, their wish fulfillment. And oftentimes they find that the grass is not greener on the other side, so they end up returning. So Cancer, your partner could tell me that they're walking away because something was brought to their attention. It could have caused a heated discussion or argument or what was brought to their attention was discovering that you had another other lover, a third party that you started a passionate new beginning out here. So they're walking away. However, your partner could tell me that they're returning here wanting to nurture this relationship, that they want to be happy. They thought long and hard about it. They want to heal things, mend things, work things out, go towards their wish, you, their soulmate. They want to get your attention. They want to make an announcement here. They want to go into some type of commitment or stability here. They want to go into some type of an agreement, some type of, you know, agreement, some type of an agreement dealing with commitment here. Returning to nurture the relationship further. Cliffhanger. I'm going to take a look at the Hidden Truth Oracle for your partner. OMG. We will see. <laughs> we will see. I'm praying we see with these cards. Can we see? Can we see? Bring some clarity here. And so... I can't stop thinking about you. I'm returning to just, let's just nurture this relationship further and let's go to higher heights. Cancer, this is a peek at your partner for July the 2nd through July the 8th, 2023. You guys, give me feedback. Subscribe, like, comment, and share. And follow me on Twitter at Her Immortal Madge, M-A-J. And I'll see you guys next week. Peace.